Pokemon Shuffle is making its way to the mobile market, and there's a little over a day left until Club Nintendo finally shuts its doors. It's Monday, June 29th, and here's the news that made the cut for the Daily Glitch. The hit free-to-play Pokemon game that has been sweeping across 3DS user systems is officially coming to the mobile platform. Pokemon Shuffle Mobile is coming to the iTunes App Store and Google Play sometime this year. In the game, it's your job to clear each stage in classic line em up Candy Crush style. The unique twist is that each match you make deals damage to a wild Pokemon. Battle, capture, or defeat that Pokemon before your turn runs out to successfully complete that level. With over 4.5 million downloads on the 3DS, it is no surprise Nintendo is making the jump to the platform that will reach a wider audience. Of course, free-to-play does not quite describe Pokemon Shuffle Mobile, as the game is heavily supported by microtransactions. Pay to play or wait it out, either way Pokemon Shuffle Mobile is set to hit phones later this year. The membership program you didn't really think about but loved cashing in on is finally closing its doors and locking its vault. Club Nintendo has been around for years, but Nintendo announced that they would be shutting down the program earlier this year. Club Nintendo members have until June 30th, or tomorrow, to cash in on their spare coins in exchange for virtual console games for the Wii, Wii U, and Nintendo 3DS. Some of the games you could pick up are classics like Super Mario World and Earthbound, and some newer titles like The Wonderful 101 and Kid Icarus Uprising. But I am not joking about doors permanently shutting down tomorrow night. Once the clock strikes 12, Club Nintendo will shut down completely, and every member will be locked out of their accounts. I guess there is a glass slipper in there somewhere, because any virtual console code you pick up will still be valid until July 31st. Nintendo did confirm that they have plans for a new rewards program to replace Club Nintendo, one that would be the foundation of the new Nintendo platform, but outside of that we have no further information on what to expect moving forward. That wraps up the news for today, but you can always stay up to date by following us on Twitter at GlitchFeed and listening to our weekly GlitchFeed podcast on iTunes and right here on YouTube.